Well, welcome back and to all our members that have been following. Here we're into our next part of our Techspert webinar series. And today we are lucky enough to have Deal Check take the time to come out here and tell us something about. I have Anton with me specifically. And for all you new investors, you want to listen up. Uh, those of you that are trying to figure out, should I get this house or shouldn't I? Should I get this multifamily commercial, no matter what it is? Anton's got an answer for you. Uh, welcome, Anton. And if you could tell us something about yourself and the company, just so everybody's aware. Uh, hi, Linda. Uh, great to be here. Thank you so much for inviting me on your uh, webinar series. Um, yeah, my name is Anton. Um, I am a pretty active buy and hold investor myself. I've been investing with my wife in rental properties across the U.S. for about six years, we're now up to a 35 rental unit portfolio. Oh. Congratulations. Uh, <laughs> thank you. Uh, so definitely understand, uh, you know, the whole process of finding deals, analyzing deals, and then obviously managing deals as a landlord. Uh, and, uh, you know, the idea for deal check came a few years ago, I think it was 2015. Um, where I was driving around a lot locally. Uh, I'm from San Diego, so I was looking for investment properties here. And I wanted a tool that I can use to quickly, uh, you know, punch in a few numbers on a deal and uh, it would give me the cash flow projections. Uh, so obviously, you know, when you're looking for new investment properties, uh, and one of the biggest things that you always want to do before buying or putting it under contract is. Uh, calculate the cash flow and see if this property will be a profitable investment. Um, and a lot of investors like myself back then have kind of relied on Excel, you know, on some custom spreadsheet that they built over the years, or maybe they got from another investor uh, to run those cash flow projections. Um, and, you know, a few years ago, that's what I was using. And I just thought, you know what, there has to be a better way to do this where, I can do it on my phone, I can do it on my tablet, I can come back later, do it on my computer, you know, and kind of uh, have more flexibility, more tools related to specifically analyzing uh, investment properties. And that's where the idea for Deal Check came uh, from, and it's a company I founded three years ago, um, and we've really been growing and expanding. Um, and, you know, I'm happy to say that we're one of the most popular property analysis tools on the market these days with over 50,000 users uh, using our software to help them find better deals and make smart investment decisions. I, you know, that, and that's just so great to hear because, you know, I, maybe you do know, maybe you don't. We spend a lot of time at conferences, et cetera, and, and this is a common pain point. So we always like to be able to share with our members solutions like this. And like you said, I. I love technology, so once you get that, and I love spreadsheets, but the but the their value is limited. So once you get it into a software like this, I'm imagining you know the analysis possibilities are endless as to how you can tweak it when you're trying to find a deal. So I'm I'm all about watching this uh, demo, that's for sure. And whatever it is, you know, what what are you? Some of your clients, fifty thousand clients, are they all over the United States? Then I imagine. Uh, we do primarily target the U.S. market, so most of our investors are in the United States. Uh, you know, we have a wide range of people using our software from kind of completely new folks who are looking for their first investment property to buy uh, to more experienced investors, you know, with five to ten plus units to even uh, kind of the bigger players who invest in commercial real estate uh, and as well as agents. Um, who use our software to generate really nice looking reports. Um, that's kind of one of our features that I'll show a little bit later. Um, and they send those to their buyers or their clients with all of the relevant information in one place. You know, you just set off a little light bulb for me because that's, that's a niche market because so, so many times the real estate agent isn't necessarily in sync with the way an investor thinks. So if they right. have a tool like this, that will help them, I'll call it sell more houses because they're more astute in the field and the way an investor thinks. Absolutely, yeah, that's why we've, we kind of have a much a growing user base of realtors mm -hmm. who really use our software and really like it because 
uh, it puts them on the same level, like you yeah. said, as an investor. It helps them present all of the metrics uh, that an investor will be looking for in a property. Um, so definitely a great uh, use case for that as well. Yeah, makes them look smart. How's that? <laughs> makes them look good. Exactly. Um, well, I'll kind of run through a few features of sure. our software, um, and uh, then I'll do a uh, hands-on demo and actually show you how it works. Uh, so, uh, deal check again is a you know tool designed specifically to analyze investment properties, um, and we've built uh, tools to analyze a variety of different deals. Uh, so you can analyze you know single-family rental properties. Uh, you can analyze flips and rehab projects. So if you're a flipper um, okay. and you want to run calculations for a flip deal, you know, customize your rehab costs, see what your profit and ROI are going to be. Uh, we've built tools for that, as well as uh, analysis for uh, larger multifamily, so two to four unit properties, as well as commercial properties. Uh, so we build specific tools that allow you to enter a rent roll, for example, for those larger multi-unit dwellings and kind of see a lot of statistics by unit and break up costs uh, in a way that commercial investors typically do. Um, so the workflow that you can follow with deal check is really simple. Um, and again, we've kind of really focused on simplicity and speed. Uh, you know, we don't want to build a bloated software that, you know, it just takes you hours to do anything. We wanted something that you can use it in your phone or online on your computer and get your cash flow projections basically in just a few seconds, you know, less than a minute. So that's great. And that's smart. That's smart. Cause uh, you know, the, that's where we're at as a society. We, we need speed. We don't need all the bells and whistles. We need speed. We need accuracy. Absolutely. So, you know, you can start with a variety of properties. Um, like I mentioned uh, here on the right, you know, single family homes, condos, manufactured properties, multifamily, commercial. We have investors who even analyze land parcels uh, if you're a land investor. Uh, you can always enter property information basically manually. Uh, if you're looking at a deal and you kind of have all the parameters in your financing, closing costs that for, that, and those sort of things. Um, or we've recently built a feature where you can actually import property data directly from the MLS uh, by just typing in the address. So you type in an address of a property, we'll pull the records and that will give you, you know, all the home facts like layout, bedroom, bathroom, square feet, rent estimate, price estimate. So it's a great way to basically get a head start and, uh, you know, quickly get all the important information about a property. Yeah, I bet uh, they love that. Yep, but definitely one of our most uh, used features. Um, okay. And you know, kind of once you import the property, you can uh, use our tools to customize the deal. Uh, we've really built a lot of flexibility into allowing you to imp uh, enter closing costs, financing, expenses, rent roll, uh, in a variety of different fashions, uh, because every real estate deal is different. Um, and we realized that, and uh, you know, we wanted our software to be easy to use, but at the same time provide the flexibility to where if you really want to drill down and enter accurate um, estimates uh, for, for example, expenses on a rental property, our software supports that. That's great. Right. That is really important. And once you kind of have that, um, you know, you can view the actual breakdown and analysis of the property. Um, and this is a one page you know, summary that will include everything that investor would need to know uh, from the breakdown of the purchase process. So how much your financing is going to be, uh, how much cash you will need up front to close on this deal. Um, obviously, the breakdown of your cash flow for rental properties uh, or, you know, profit projections after a sale for a flip. Um, and then over a dozen uh, return calculations like cap rate, cash on cash return, ROI, IRR, um, you know, and then you can view long-term projections for rental properties up to 35 years. Wow. Um, so you actually can take, uh, you know, this deal and see, okay, you know, I plan to hold on to it for 10 years, 15 years. Uh, how is my cash flow going to change over time and what my ROI is going to be over that long-term period? Uh, Another cool tool that we've built um, and a lot of investors like it is our offer calculator. So 
uh, you know, once you have a deal, once you see all the numbers, a lot of the times uh, it may not really work, uh, you know, exactly how you want it to. So maybe, you know, you're targeting a cap rate, let's say of 6%, uh, but the deal came out at like 5.5 or, you know, you're really looking for $200 a month or more in cash flow. Uh, but it just came out a little less than that. So what we've done is we built basically a max offer calculator, um, and that's a tool that uses reverse valuation yeah, yeah. Uh, to help you figure out what is the price that you can offer to meet all of your criteria. So if you have that cap rate of six, minimum cash flow of $250 a month or $200 a month, uh, you just type it in, and our software will calculate the minimum price that you can pay uh, to still make this deal work for you. And this is a great way to basically draft an offer to the seller. Yeah, I uh, love that. I love that. I used to work with a lot of data analysis tools. That's great that you have that reverse field. So I did it all up front, but now it didn't right. work. But if I offer less, how much less? Perfect. Yeah, exactly. So it'll tell you exactly, hey, here's the price. And this could be the starting point for drafting an offer, for example, to the seller. Uh, and, you know, that way it will, the deal will work for you. Uh, and uh, kind of one of our other really popular features are PDF reports. Um, so you can, once you have all the analysis, all the inputs, you know, you've customized them to your liking, uh, you can actually one click export all of the information for this property in one complete report with pictures, maps, any notes you have added, and obviously the analysis calculations. A lot of investors like this because if you have partners or yeah. Uh, you know, clients that you work with or even lenders that would like to see the uh, property kind of projections and analysis before closing the deal with you, this would be a great document to send to you, uh, to send those people. Uh, yeah. You know, it looks like you spent hours putting it together and put a lot of information and thought into it where it really took you less than five minutes uh, to generate this PDF report. So, you know, in uh, the current, great to share the property. Information. Yeah. And in the current economic climate where deals are hard to come by and three, four people are going after them, you know, something like that is just enough to give you, I'll call it the slight edge to get your loan approved just a little bit quicker. Cause you're right. not, you're not just throwing a spreadsheet. You're giving a report. You're saying, here's my stuff. Here's the numbers. Here's the pictures. You've answered all questions up front. I love that. That's really good. And like you said, for partners, like, come on, let's move forward. Here's what I got. Look at the numbers. You know, you, it, the speed is of the essence today, and this is really helpful. Absolutely, and kind of goes our, with our whole principle of, you know, our software being really fast, really easy to use, and uh, this is just one of the examples where we allow an investor to put together basically a professional uh, mm -hmm. You know, looking PDF with all the information, all the research in a matter of minutes, send that out in an email and close on the deal that yeah. otherwise, uh, you know, that person may have missed because it, they just didn't have the time to put together the information. Yeah, I love that. That's great. Um, and kind of the, you know, I like to always talk about the three main uh, value propositions that we focus on. The first one is... Uh, you know, always accurate analysis every time. Um, what we've seen before and myself personally, when we use the Excel spreadsheets, it's very easy to make mistakes, mm -hmm. uh, especially when you're a new investor, you got some spreadsheet from a friend, you don't really know the formulas yourself and you're basically relying on somebody else's math uh, to make uh, pretty substantial decisions with your finances mm -hmm. that will affect your future uh, mm -hmm. and your family's future. Um, and we've, uh, you know, we've obviously have a software that's based on standard uh, time tested formulas that are uh, used by all real estate investors. You, you don't have to guess at what the formula is. It's provided for you. Um, and we have a full glossary uh, that I'll kind of show in a minute here that has all of the formulas listed. So if you're curious, how is cap rate calculated? How is ROI calculated? There is a tooltip that you can mouse over that will show you the exact formula so you don't have to guess as what's really happening um, and really help you save, uh, you know, not only save time, but avoid mistakes in your analysis. Right, exactly. Reduce the risk. <clears throat> um, and I already talked about speed. You know, we're all about speed here. We really try to limit the amount of time you spend, you know, crunching numbers, doing math, give you the relevant data faster. Um, and with our kind of mobile to 
uh, desktop integration uh, with, with sync, you know, your data syncs between any device you use that allows you to make decisions out on the field when you're driving around at open houses or back in the office and you're not kind of wasting time copying data, moving data around. Uh, right. You can just focus on buying you know, the deal. <laughs> yeah. Make a deal. Right. right. Um, and uh, no learning curve. Um, again, we've tried to make our software very intuitive, very easy to use, even for new investors. Uh, we share all of our calculation formulas inside the software if you want to learn and, or, or you're just new and you're not familiar with how the math is done. Um, and we do have, uh, you know, seven day a week customer service support with live chat. And we have an extensive help portal that you know, if you do want to kind of get familiar with the more advanced features of our software, if you're stuck, uh, we have tons of, uh, you know, step-by-step -step guides with screenshots that walk you through uh, all features of our software so you're not just kind of lost as, hey, what am I supposed to be doing here? Right, right. That's great. Uh, For the true like newbie I, that's just getting started, that, you know, they, they sometimes need that. Right. Um, and over 50,000 professionals, like I mentioned, use our software to analyze both rentals and flips. Uh, most of them are investors. Uh, we also have a growing number of realtors uh, who use our uh, reports specifically to present properties to their clients uh, who are investors looking to buy properties. Uh, we even have homeowners who are maybe thinking about turning their home into a rental, um, see what the cash flow is going to look like on that. So uh, definitely try to cater to a very large group of people, but obviously real estate investors, um, you know, existing landlords who are looking to buy more properties or brand new uh, investors who are looking for their first deal are our main target audience. That's great. Um, so I'll, um, I'll give a little demo of our software, just uh, show you how our property analysis tools work. You got a big uh, and, endorsement down there. I have to comment in the corner because I know him, Narada. So that's a great endorsement. Absolutely. Yeah, we've been featured by a number of publications. And like I said, I think ever since we launched uh, a few years ago, people have been realizing that, uh, you know, we are very customer driven. We're very open to customer feedback. And in fact, a lot of the features that we've been adding and continue to add come directly from uh, our customer requests. Yeah. Um, so if you see something and uh, you know, you, you feel like we could improve or add a new tool, uh, let us know. Uh, we're very open to uh, new suggestions. And I think a lot of the people have been realizing that. So we get quite a bit of, yeah, those are, those are awesome. Those are awesome recommendations. Um, so deal check, uh, you can try it for free. Uh, mm -hmm. before we kind of jump into the demo. Um, and again, you can use it online. So if you go to uh, dealcheck.io, that's our website that I was just showing. And there's a link to, uh, you know, one of the green buttons to try it for free. Uh, we don't ask for your credit card up front. You just need to create an account. Um, or you can try it on your phone or tablet. Uh, we support iOS and Android. Uh, just search for dealcheck. Uh, on the Apple Store or the Google Play Store, or we have uh, these little download buttons on the bottom corner of our website as well. Perfect. So we'll do a quick demo. Uh, sure. And uh, this is our actual software. So I logged in, and uh, when you create a new account, we kind of create some example uh, rental property um, as well as an example flip property for you. Um, so if you don't have a deal immediately that you'd like to uh, analyze, uh, you know, you can browse these basically uh, templates that we've created for you just kind of to see what our analysis tools like. Sure, that's uh, perfect. Uh, just to get them familiar with the software prior to actually needing it. Good idea. Absolutely. Uh, but I'll kind of go through the process of adding a new rental property, which again, we try to make really simple. Uh, we have an ability to enter everything manually. So that's our kind of enter manually option here in the middle. Uh, if the property is not on the MLS or you just want to enter a few details selectively, our step-by-step -step wizard will walk you through that. Um, I'm going to go ahead and try our import from the MLS feature, uh, which uh, very easy to use. All you need is the property address. So we're going to go ahead, punch that in right here. 
and search. Uh, and uh, we found our property. So this is a single family home in Atlanta uh, that I'm just using as an example. And as you can see, we've pulled in all of the available information to save you time. So bedroom, bathroom, square footage, uh, year built. There is um, a wealth of kind of other information about appliances, floor coverings, uh, construction material, uh, if you need to know that. Got uh, it. Yeah, if that's the great. property is listed, which this one is currently not, there would be a list price, uh, but for another, just a market uh, value estimate and the last sale price, um, as well as some school information uh, and photos, if there are any. So we're going to go ahead and import this property, basically copy it to our account, uh, and now we can actually drill down and analyze it. So... Um, the worksheet page that I just clicked on is where you basically enter uh, all of the parameters of the deal. You can customize your purchase price, your closing costs, your expenses. So we'll just go ahead and edit a few of these fields to uh, basically make it more representative of the typical um, arrangements that you may have with financing. Um, and as I mentioned, um, a lot of our tools can be uh, used quickly. So for example, stuff like purchase costs, rehab costs, we always give you an option to enter a general estimate if you just want to say, you know, my closing costs are 3%, my rehab is perhaps 10,000. Uh, you know, quickly enter those numbers and give you some rough calculations. Uh, you can itemize any of these costs and numbers uh, and basically enter them one at a time with a variety of different ways you can enter them if you want to spend a little more time uh, putting the actual numbers, which will ultimately give you more accurate estimates. Um, so up to you, uh, I guess, depending on how much uh, effort you want to put into the analysis part. So you can customize rent, uh, vacancy, any other income you will have for this rental property. Uh, we talked about operating expenses a little earlier. As you can see, we filled in um, a lot of the common expenses for you, but you can always come in um, and enter your own numbers based on uh, what you see in the area. So we're gonna go ahead and enter some basic assumptions here. Don't need any of these other ones. Um, so once you kind of customize all of the parameters, um, you go to the analysis summary, and this is the page that I mentioned that has mm -hmm. basically the full breakdown of what this deal is going to look like for you. Uh, the first section is the purchase uh, and rehab. Uh, so you will see the price you're buying it, uh, what your financing amount, what your loan to value ratio is going to be, what is the required down payment, and then your purchase rehab costs, and ultimately your uh, total cash needed. So this is basically your upfront cash requirement that you will need to uh, close this deal. And then scrolling down, uh, you will see the cash flow breakdown for the first year. Uh, so we factor in, in uh, everything that you input, uh, you know, starting with rent, vacancy, any other income, uh, if there's stuff like laundry income or, uh, you know, storage rental at the property, which in sure. this case we didn't enter any. Uh, we factor in all of the expenses that you entered, uh, calculate your net operating income, your loan payments, and ultimately your cash flow. So you can see, hey, this is my net uh, cash flow that I will actually receive per month or per year uh, for this property, which is a metric a lot of investors like to see, obviously. Sure, sure. Those are great. Um, and I and love that you can enter in those expenses one at a time because sometimes you just want to get that te detailed and other times you just want to get a ballpark, you know? Absolutely. That's, and that's, I said, our software provides the flexibility. Mm -hmm. If you say, well, you know, I'm just using the 50% rule or something similar. Uh, let me just throw in a quick estimate. Uh, or maybe later on you're actually serious about buying this property um, and you say, you know what, I'm going to look up the property tax bill, the insurance bill, right. um, and actually enter those to get a more accurate cash flow projection. That's perfect. Because um, I know if I want to make a bid or not, it you know gives me that high level, okay, yay or nay, and then I can get into detail you know, if I've got the time. Absolutely. Um, and down at the bottom, you'll see various uh, number of return and financial ratio calculations. So 
things like I mentioned, cap rate, cash on cash return, ROI, return on equity, uh, internal rate of return, uh, gross rent multiplier, where we basically try to cover every single metric that an investor may want to see. Um, you know, some of these you may, you may never heard of or not yeah. used. Uh, that's fine with us. And uh, as you can see, there's a help icon next to each of these metrics. So if you're not familiar with what it is, just mouse over it. We'll give you the exact formula that our software uses to calculate that, as well as kind of a brief description to help you uh, learn it, understand it, uh, see, you know, what's the importance of this and how you may use it to make investment decisions. And, and you know what I'm thinking that really helps the new investor too with that whole loan situation because that loan officer might start throwing those acronyms at them and they're not quite sure they, they but luckily they have this tool and they know how to answer them you know if they're just getting started so that's really helpful right and I remember when I was a new guy people were saying you know cap rate COC yeah, yeah. ROI I was like you know what are they talking whoa, about whoa whoa yeah it just like it's going back and forth yep so we like to kind of build that into our software. You know, obviously you can search online for these terms and read more about them, which is great. But if you kind of need that quick reference, quick yeah. formula, it's all right here available inside deal check. Um, so this is kind of the numbers for year one. I mentioned before we have a projections page, mm. which basically shows uh, how all of these numbers and your returns will evolve over time. So whether you kind of have an exit strategy in place right off the bat you know you say maybe i want to hold on to this property for five or ten years uh, or you don't necessarily have an exit strategy and you just want to see you know 20 years down the road uh what is going to be my cash flow uh or you know 30 years down the road after my mortgage is paid off what you know what's going to happen to my cash flow so uh we use assumptions based uh you know what the rental income increase is going to be what the expense uh, increase is going to be that you can fully customize for each deal uh, okay. to basically project all these numbers over time. Uh, we show things like your equity accumulation and your loan paid down. So you can see when your loan is going to be paid off, what your equity in the property is going to be at each year in case, for example, you're planning to refinance and you want to see how much you want to withdraw. Uh, we calculate tax benefits like depreciation and loan interest that you may be able to deduct. Uh, on your tax returns Very nice. um, and obviously all of the investment returns and financial ratios to see how they will uh, progress over time. Um, some other features that you can do for each deal, uh, you can upload photos. Um, so obviously we can import photos directly from the MLS. If you have your own custom photos, perhaps from an inspection uh, or a drive by visit you did, you can always upload them. Uh, you can add notes, links to videos, uh, oh, that's you know, great. any kind of description for each property, maybe to help you jog your memory later. Or if you're sending this to your friends or investors or partners, you know, you can add your thoughts uh, oh, to this property. Yeah, that's great. Really great. And um, that basically takes us to the PDF report, uh, which collects all of this information uh, puts it in one nice PDF that you can generate with one click. So I'm going to go ahead and do that right now. Um, and you'll see, you know, instantly we've put in all of the information about this property, uh, the photos that you've uploaded, uh, all of the property description, you know, showing its location in the city and kind of neighborhood level, uh, all of the home facts like beds, baths, square footage. Um, and then we dive right into your, uh, you know, purchase analysis and returns. So what is your financing going to look like? Uh, what are the assumptions you're using for, you know, vacancy and appreciation and income increase, so forth, what your returns are going to be, uh, and obviously the breakdown of your cash flow. Uh, so monthly and yearly net operating income cash flow estimates, um, as well as a full breakdown of your expenses. Uh, the projections uh, table makes it in here as well in the report. Um, so this is great if this is a long-term investment. Mm -hmm. um, all of the projections, um, you know, can be shared in a nice table. You can look at what's going to happen for each year's. Um, and then any property photos and notes you have added will be included in the report as well. 
Yeah, I'm, I'm really super impressed with, I, well, I'm impressed with all the features, I really am, but I think the, the report for especially in, in light of the new person, but even the really experienced one that's going out there and trying to raise money, private money, I, I, to me, it just makes him or her look like a professional when they're out there trying to raise money and stuff like that. That's perfect. Yep. And uh, if you kind of want to take it a step uh, up, we have, a, you know, you can add your own branding to the report. You can upload your logo, uh, contact information, you know, details, um, basically hide all references to deal check software. So it looks like you're the person who made the report. Um, a lot of agents use this feature. Even uh, like I mentioned earlier, we have different types of investors. We have a lot of wholesalers use our software. Um, and specifically the PDF report feature to basically send the properties to their buyers list. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, I, you know, it certainly way. looks like you've put the time and you've, I, I, what I'd say is you've been listening, you know, these are the type of things that I hear in all these REI meetings, these conferences, and you've certainly like, I'll call it addressed all those issues. That's great. Absolutely. Um, and I'll kind of show you the offer calculator that we talked about a little bit uh, yeah. before. So, uh, you know, a natural next step, once you've got all the numbers for the property, you say, hey, you know, I like this deal, but um, you know what, uh, maybe I'm looking for, uh, you know, at least 200, uh, you know, 50 cash flow, uh, maybe a cap rate of, you know, 9% or something like that. Uh, and the deal doesn't quite fit it, but as you can see, we will instantly recalculate your highest offer up at the top. So in this case, it says, you know what, uh, if you drop 5K off the price and, and offer 90,000 instead of 95,000, you will meet all of your criteria. Um, and you can basically uh, use any uh, return metrics, uh, you know, like cap rate, cash on cash, return on investment as your target for this calculation. So depending on uh, what specific uh, kind of properties that, that you want to target, you know, if it's just cash flow and cap rate, or maybe you have a specific return on investment that you're looking for. Uh, you just enable that calculation and enter your target and deal check will calculate the highest offer for you. Uh, this could be a great start to actually writing your offer to the seller. Uh, you know, now you have an educated decision, uh, mm -hmm. an educated mm -hmm. number that you're actually sending them instead of guessing or ballparking. Right. Uh, because, you know, you know that, okay, if I offer, you know, 90,000, I'm going to basically meet my investment goals and this property is going to be attractive for me. Um, so um, that's kind of a brief demo. And again, your properties are uh, always stored uh, in, in your account. So we just added this one and uh, you can access this on your phone uh, okay. instantly. So if I logged in on my phone and logged into my, my deal check account, my properties will be there. Uh, a lot of people really like this cloud sync feature because it allows them to analyze and look at their properties, uh, you know, no matter where they are. Yeah. Uh, so that's obviously something that's very hard to do with Excel. You know, it's, you kind of enter the numbers in a spreadsheet and it sits on your computer. And right. if you're on a different computer and if you're on your phone, now you can access it. Yeah, and I like the thought of like, uh, let's just say I could see it going mobile to desktop back to mobile. So now you're Absolutely. out there in the field again and you're talking to other people and you could just pull it up and say, yeah, well, I can't remember what was that. And you can just pull it right up, you know. You can pull it up. You can view your notes. Uh, you know, when you're talking to people, you don't have to say like, well, I'll get back to you after yeah. I recalculate my cash flow. Uh, you can actually, you know, close on the deal or come up with a price with your agent while you're there, you know, you can use the offer calculator on your phone to actually calculate the offer price, you know, tell your agent, uh, you know, let's offer this amount and, and that's that. So it really kind of gives you the power to have these analysis tools go with you um, and, uh, you know, serve you, uh, serve you well, no matter where you are and kind of allow you to make quick decisions, which a lot of times like out Linda is the key to closing deals especially in a very competitive market yeah and that's what we're in I mean uh, that's what we're in that's the common I'll call it theme that I hear wherever they're at like not enough deals there's not enough deals and yet the deals are there but you got to be astute like this you have to have tools like this so you can move and you can be agile and you can know what kind of offers and I love that reverse engineer that's just perfect 
you know, let, let's, okay, I'm going to hit this target. What offer can I give them? It's worth a shot. You know, I like it. I really like it. Very Absolutely. valuable. Um, and really quickly, we've kind of been working on the rental side. Like I mentioned, we do have a full suite of tools available for analyzing flips as well. I'll just click on this example flip deal. Um, as you can see for a flip, you'll still see your purchase and rehab breakdown. So how much is going to uh, cost to buy the property, the rehab cost, which you can fully customize, <clears throat> find out your total cash needed. Uh, and obviously the main section that you'll want to see is your sale and profit. So how much the after repair value is going to be, uh, what your ultimate proceeds and then your profit and ROI uh, from a flip. Um, and you can again use our offer calculator. A lot of flip investors use it to basically uh, help them come up with a purchase price that will give them say, you know, at least 30,000 profit, uh, a certain ROI. Uh, so great for analyzing flips as well. Yeah. And, um, and I thought it was important when you said too, for the wholesalers out there that are trying to move these properties, get, get those numbers out there quick, get them out to the other people. And then if somebody's going to flip it, so, you know, most oftentimes they want nothing to do with the flip. That's why they've gotten into the wholesaling so they can just move them quicker, you know? Absolutely. So if you're kind of passing on the deal yourself uh, or you're a full-time wholesaler, you can always send the report to your buddies or your buyer's list. Uh, you know, it already has all of the information you need in that PDF for what an investor would be looking for. Uh, and, you know, it will uh, help you present the property to your buyers um, and basically attract buyers for your wholesale deals. Well, um, I, you know, I can't thank you enough. Is there any other features you want to make sure they know about? Or um, I'm going to put your, all your links. I will have all that, you know. Absolutely. Below. No, I think that's a, that's a pretty good, obviously we have a lot of more advanced features <laughs> I that I think you'll figure out once you use the software. Um, like I mentioned before, we have full step-by-step -step guides. So we have a full help portal oh, nice. uh, with tons of guides, with screenshots and, you know, uh, walkthroughs of what to put for each input, uh, help you, you know, walk through the process of analyzing a deal if you're a new investor or uh, if you've been using our software for a while, uh, it will help you kind of learn the more little advanced or tips and tricks, uh, so to speak, to help you become even more productive. Uh, and uh, the last thing I just wanted to mention is, like I said, our software uh, is free to use for a basic account. So you can register online at, uh, uh, you know, dealcheck.io uh, or you can download the DealCheck mobile app to your phone and tablet. Just search for DealCheck on Apple uh, Store or Google Play Store. Uh, we do have a, uh, what we call a pro upgrade that comes with a little more features and less restrictions. It's, it's very cheap in my opinion. It's, it's literally a, a, you know, one, two cups of coffee uh, <laughs> a month. Um, and uh, specifically for the listeners of this webinar, I did set up a special uh, promo code uh, so that we can post it probably below as well in the sure. notes. Uh, but the promo code is landlord25. Um, so that's L A N D L O R D 25. Um, okay. So landlord25. Uh, it will give you a 25% discount off our pro plan if you choose to upgrade. Um, again, you don't have to. You can use DealCheck for free for as long as you like. Uh, we always support our free users with the same kind of level of customer support. Um, and care, but if you kind of are, you know, get familiar with our software, want a little bit more features, uh, like what we're doing, would like to support our company in future developments, uh, you can upgrade it with the promo code landlord25, get 25% off. It'll be probably about the cost of a coffee cup a month uh, to basically give you a substantial edge over other investors and give you access to professional analysis tools on any platform. I, I'm again, I can't, um, I'll call it endorse it enough that it, it's a great, the, between the tour and the demo and everything you've shown, it's really, really a needed product in the market. And now more than ever, let's put it that way. Now more than ever. I mean, I've always probably over the last eight to 10 years, I'd say it's been competitive, but it's really competitive right now. And th something like this really gives people an edge. So I, I can't Absolutely. thank you enough for taking the time out to do this. Uh, it's so helpful for the people that are, you know, investing and watching and trying to learn. And 
we really, really appreciate um, the fact that you took the time to do this with us today. It was my pleasure, Linda. Um, and again, kind of one of my uh, full-time goals for starting this business in the first place uh, was to help other investors, uh, you know, become more successful, close on more deals and, and make more educated investment decisions. So uh, would love for your listeners to try this and viewers to try the software out. Um, and once again, we're super responsive to feedback. In fact, when you log in, you'll get an email from me directly. Uh, so you'll have my direct email address. You can send me feedback, feature requests um, anytime, and uh, we'll, you know, we'll promise to do our best to incorporate them in future updates. Well, thank you again. Thank you so much, sincerely. And I hope I get to meet you at one of these uh, conferences or references. And uh, thank you, because this certainly is giving back to this community. Absolutely, Linda. Thanks again for inviting me. Okay. I'm going to say... Uh, Thank you again for, and I'm just going to repeat, this is Anton from The Deal Check. And if you're interested, please see the notes below. I'll have all the links there. Thank you so much. I'm going to go ahead and stop recording.